but he did ask. This was a request. <laughs> people and welcome back to my channel if this is your first time watching I'm Sheree welcome here on this channel I do cover fashion beauty luxury and lifestyle so if you like any of those things or all of those things go ahead and consider hitting the subscribe button if you want to ensure that you never miss a video or post or anything over here go ahead and tap the notification bell it will alert you every single time there is a post a video or something that's going on over here on the channel without further ado we're gonna jump right in this year 2022 is all about putting dents and my fragrances I just feel that life is short and I choose to live and one of the ways that I live and I live out loud is by spraying my fragrances and spraying as much as I want when I want and spraying what makes me happy so while I cannot commit to a fragrance tray because that's just not my style I'm not a real big I don't know I have commitment issues when it comes to something like a fragrance like I'm only gonna spray these oh no I can't because some days I feel different and I'm reaching for something different so whatever I spray on Monday I put on the tray whatever I spray on Tuesday I put on the tray and then I the end of the week I come and I tell you guys about them that's a little bit of another way for me to go more in depth on a fragrance that maybe I haven't touched on so if you're here for something like that please sit back and allow me to inform you and let you know my thoughts opinions and impressions on these fragrances again if you enjoy the content do not forget to hit the subscribe button and make sure you come over and join me on Instagram we have a great time over there okay you guys on Monday Mondays are like my weekends are so hard or my weekends well before my my weekends felt like mini vacations you know what i mean it was like oh my gosh so monday it comes in and it's like oh my gosh i need a really good fragrance because it's monday okay and sometime monday be monday and, and i'm just like i need a really good fragrance and i need about two to three cups of coffee but that's a different story we're not here to talk about that but she is a huge coffee lover so i kicked off monday with a new one that has been recently added to my collection and that is Casilli. uh this is by parfums damali you guys this here is Casilli. you guys this this is beautiful I'm not gonna keep you waiting I'm not gonna you know draw it out long it out no 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 no. I'm a meat and potato kind of girl give me give me it and give me a fast did you like her or did you not I'm not here to play no games I love this this is good it's beautiful it's a warm floral uh, fragrance to me it is very uh, pretty it's very creamy it has a little bit of depth to it it's very sensual it just made me feel pretty it's a pretty girl fragrance to me if I were to categorize this fragrance I would put it in my pretty girl fragrance scent I would put it in brunch I would would put it in girls day girls night um it is kind of sensual but it's not sexy sexy it's a pretty girl fragrance in my opinion a few of the notes in here you guys is red currant that's the fruity note that you have coming in here you do have the bulgarian rolls that comes through really strong you definitely get that frangipani you have that as well plum and mimosa the plum in here is what's making it a tad bit sensual to me a little sexy to me like i said down in the base you have your vanilla tonka bean and sandalwood it's a very warm creamy beautiful moderate when it comes to longevity type of fragrance this is not going to get on you and hold you tight like Delina does it's not going to get on you and hold you tight like Delina does it did give me about a seven to eight hour wear I did spray it really heavy I could get it to go about nine hours if I really put on my Delina cream and then spray it on top of it and really spray everywhere when I say spray everywhere I mean sprinkler system I mean I'm talking 10 15 20 sprays that's just how I spray there's no judgment over here we don't do that spray according to how you like to spray she sprays heavy I like it I like fragrance I love fragrance so that's what I did with this one so this was Monday I move on on Tuesday I wore this one here this is by Byredo this is Mojave Ghost now this right here I didn't remember it acting like this, but this week it showed up and it showed out. It was like, show up, show up, show out, show out. If you know the song, just hit the like button. If you don't, it's okay, just hit the subscribe button. Nevertheless, just hit a button. Anyways, you guys, this is what I wore on Tuesday. Violet, floral, cedar, sandalwood, ambergris. It's beautiful. I paired it with the Mojave Ghost by Radle body cream and I layered it and it purred and got on me and held me tight like nobody's business some people would say this is spring summer like I say I spray what I want when I want and I spray as much of it as I want and I encourage you all to do the same spray what you want when you want and spray as much of it as you want life is short I want to spray my fragrances and I want to be able to smell them so one two three is never gonna get me the kind of reaction that I want so I go in and I spray very heavy not saying that you should do that but that's how I spray I get that question a lot how many fragrance um 
spritz view spray and I, I spray a lot 10 15 20 25 even depending on the fragrance too this one here normally I didn't think it was that long lasting but I probably went in with about 15 to 20 sprays and it purred and lasts on me like nobody's business like eight to nine hours and I did have the body cream so let's make a mention of that as well I move on on Wednesday what did I wear on Wednesday oh oh yeah because I told you guys in another video that I was gonna start spraying this because I had recently got it from the cosmetic company store and if you do not know what the cosmetic company store is, bro, guy, allow me 2.5 to put you on. Cosmetic company store has tons of makeup. I believe they have hair products. I don't believe, I can't recall if I've ever been to the store, but Chris Love Lux, I heard her mention it on her channel here on YouTube. I then said, okay, I've got to call out and reach out to them and see if they have Tom Ford Lost Cherry. You can get certain fragrances like Tom Ford, Joe Malone. Um, they have Michael Kors. They have... What else do they have? They have some other fragrances, but Tom Ford is what I'm normally looking for. And you can get it for sometime 40, 30, even up to 50% off, even with another discount on top of that. And they also give you nice like gifts with purchase. So I made a whole nother order for that. That'll be coming soon and I'll be sharing that with you guys. But that is where I received Tom Ford Velvet Orchid from. I paid half price, 50% off, and it is an amazing fragrance. So if you have not checked out the cosmetic store, the cosmetic company store, check it out. Some of you have asked Ashray, what's the number? But listen, go to Google, type in cosmetic company store. There are probably going to be some that's going to come up. I call to every single one. There's about 10 of them near me or in the surrounding area. Even if it's not, it doesn't matter. If you order over a certain amount, they will ship it to you for free. No extra when it comes to the shipping. I call around and I'm like, hello, I have them on speed deal. I'm like, hello, do you have Tom Ford, blah, blah, blah. And they're like, no. Do you have blah, blah, blah? Yes. Okay, wrap it up, send it to me. It's just that easy. Never say I didn't put you on. I'm always gonna share and throw with you. So that is where I received this from. You guys, this is really good. It's creamy, it's sensual, it's sexy, it's Tom Ford, darling. I mean, come on now, come on. If you know, you know I am a Tom Ford girl. I absolutely love Tom's fragrances, not all of them. Let's be clear. <laughs> because on a few of them, I'm like, Tom, you should have called me. I would have told you. But anyways, um, he's a master. I am not. So anyways, uh, this fragrance has in it, it's sweet, it's honey, it's rose, it's rum, it's amber, it's spicy, it's vanilla, it's creamy, it's rich, it's sexy. I slept in this and it was given what they said it was supposed to have given. Okay? It was given what they said it was supposed to have gave. <laughs> It definitely was giving. This right here is good. If you're looking for something sensual, sexy, date night-esque, okay? That's what category I would compartmentalize this in, date night. This right here is good, good. I move on. Thursday, I wanted to <sighs> smell different. So I wanted to reach for something that I rarely reach for. And like I said, start putting a dent in it. And I reached for Reckless by Roja. Now this was sent over by the brand. I believe it was last year they released the Essence brand and a ton of creators here on YouTube received so many perfumes from Roja Dove and it was absolutely amazing and I received some as well. Super exciting um, when I received those fragrances and my favorite out of the Essence line was Parfums 51. But this one here is Reckless. It's sexy, it's rich, it has a ton and ton of notes in it. Immediately when I sprayed it on Thursday night after my shower you guys it gave me reminisce of Killian's love absolutely I don't know why it just did I beautiful mister too I love how the mister is on this oh my gosh I should have not sprayed that much I'm gonna start sneezing it does but it's 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 dressy it's not as sweet it's not as creamy but it definitely gave me reminisce of Love Don't Be Shy. Over here in the fragrance, you guys, like I said, it has a ton of notes in it. I'll give you a few. Mandarin rose, jasmine, vanilla, cinnamon, pink pepper, sandalwood. It is a beautiful fragrance. It's not very long lasting. Can I say that? Very long lasting. It's not long, long lasting. Um, I would say about a four to five hour out of it. And then it was more or less, not a skin scent, but it's set really close to the body. Here's an example, a quick 2.5. If you were going to meet some someone okay let's just say someone and you want it to be you know sexy and you wanted to put something on but you don't want to seem like you have tried or you have been waiting for them to come over all day but you wanted to be like this is how I smelled at nine o'clock this morning put this on and in about two to three hours it would smell like that's what you smelled you know early this morning it sits very close to the body it's very Netflix and chill a uh, sexy date night or just smell yourself kind of fragrance to me this isn't gonna get on your body and project and scream and leave a scent trail on a 
scent bubble and I sprayed pretty heavy I probably did about 10 to 12 sprays and I didn't get that after about the fourth or fifth hour it was very faint it sat very close to my body and if you were to come in my personal space you would have definitely smelled me but if you were just like standing you know across the way especially through the mask you would have not smelled me because I you know had to go in for the you know, to smell me, but it's a beautiful fragrance. So a lot of times, a lot of you are saying, hey, what can I wear that's not that loud, that's not off-putting, that's not in your face. You might be able to get away with this. I wouldn't say spray heavy if you work in like a medical field or anything like that, because I get a lot of those questions, but definitely this would be something that you would be able to rock. You wouldn't be in anyone's face. You wouldn't be offensive or you wouldn't be off-putting. I move on. Now on Friday, I do have a story time with this. You guys, I always tell you, okay, if you're new to the channel, I say this all the time. And if you're not new to the channel, help me out. If you've heard me say this before, just say she says it all the time. I can only give to you what a fragrance gives to me or what I get from a fragrance, okay? So I did wear on Friday, I was going to get my hair done. It was time for the whole takedown break. Did you guys see my hair VV video? I did a whole like wig install. I was so proud of myself. Okay, girl, we are not here for that. But anyways, um, check that video if you haven't. Even if you don't wear units, wigs, whatever, it's just fun to watch you guys. I was all over the place, but I tried and I did a good job. At least I was proud of myself. So anyways, um. I was going to get my hair done and I always like to wear a nice fragrance to get my hair done anywhere I go. But I didn't want to wear anything, you know, off-putting or spray too heavy or too crazy because I was going to be in close proximity with someone and she is expecting. So I didn't want to go in and just set it off. You know what I mean? As I know I could. But I reached for something that I've recently added back in my collection and that is Wood Sage and Sea Salt by Jo Malone. This is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful fragrance. Wood Sage and Sea Salt, like I said, Sea Salt, Sage, Grapefruit, Sea Wood weed beautiful fragrance very fresh very clean it was exactly what it was finished my workout took a shower out of the shower sprayed this and then before I went to get my hair done of course I had to stop and make myself a cup of coffee because I didn't want to stop at Starbucks hello because I wanted to have the whole pot instead of just a cup so I made a pot of coffee and my guy was on a call and he comes in and he's like oh my gosh you smell so good what is that and it's not even like a sexy beast mode fragrance either He's like, what is that? I've smelled that on you before. Years ago, I used to wear this. I ran out, I didn't really repurchase it. And then finally, um, Sephora had a sale and I recently have added it back to the collection. So it stirred a memory for him. And he's like, didn't you wear this before? And I'm like, yes. He was like, I love it. It's sexy, it's so fresh, it's so clean. I really like it. And I'm like, oh my gosh, <laughs> okay. She'll be wearing it again. So you guys, it is really good. If you are looking for something, another one. And like I said, I'm saying this because I get this question all the time. And you work in close proximities with others or you are in the medical field or you are in the dental field or anything, healthcare provider, I should say. And you want something to smell fresh clean beautiful upbeat anything like that you can check out amazing grace I'll pop a picture or you can check out something like this now I have heard and I'm sure we all have heard Joe Malone's fragrances don't last you guys this got on me and it gave me a good four to five hours now when it comes to getting a compliment I did receive a compliment from this I received two and you know it was even through the mask so I did receive a compliment from it and the next day we were gonna go to brunch and my guy's like, um, can you just wear that again? And I'm like, uh, no, I have a lot of fragrances to get through. We can't be repeating fragrances in the same week. But he did ask, this was a request for him to wear this twice in one week. But she said, no, I had something else for Saturday and I'm gonna share that with you next. So if you have not checked out Jo Malone, Wood Sage and Sea Salt, I highly recommend it. It is good, good, I move on. That brings me to Saturday. Saturday was a different kind of Saturday. We got up, all of a sudden, I don't know, it was just impulse too. We're like, uh, you wanna make breakfast? No, let's go to brunch. Okay, so we're like, okay, let's go to brunch. So I put on something easy breezy, some type of lounge set from H&M, somewhere like that, or Zara, one of them. And I put on some trainers, a cute scarf, a big bag, oversized sunnies. And what fragrance did I reach for, you may ask? I reached for Gentle Fluidy Gold. It was only right. I had cute stud earrings on, I had my oversized sunglasses and I needed something to dress up the outfit a little bit more making me feel a little bit more luxurious my bag was giving Lux vibes my glasses were giving Lux vibes and my trainers and I just needed to complete the look oh did I wear a hat that day yes I did I even wore like a cute beanie that day it was very you know it was like you know all decked out it was one of those kinds and I needed something to fit the bill so I reached for gentle fluidy goat beautiful fragrance coriander vanilla musk very powdery it gave me very rich luxe vibes and I absolutely loved it. Um, if you have not tried Gentle Fluidy Goat, I would highly recommend it. A lot of times people talk a lot about Baccarat, but this would be a great way to go if you're looking for something. And I also hear a lot of people, oh, I don't want to wear Baccarat. Everybody wears it. Everybody wears it. 
One thing about me, I'm gonna wear what I wanna wear. I don't care who wears it because there's only one me and can't nobody do it like me. Just like I feel nobody can do it like you. So if there's a fragrance that you like and somebody else is rocking it, put your own spin on it. I love listening to the Sherry's TV. I think that's it, the Sherry's TV. Am I saying that right? Yes, her name is Abby. I call her Abby. I talk to her all the time. And I love how she puts her own spin on her fragrances. She always mixes it with something or she always has like a combo, a layering combo. I'm gonna link her channel below. She has an amazing channel for, you know, just all things fragrance, but she cooks. I mean, she does it all, okay? She cooks, she's got a vlogging channel. I could be making that up, but I think I heard her say that. Anyways, I'm gonna link her channel in the description box below, you guys, tell her I sent you. But she has all type of layering combos. She has all type of stuff, and she never lets that stop her from wearing a fragrance because no matter what she wears, she said she layers it with something. She's always talking about something molecules, a one, or something like that that helps the fragrance last. You guys, like I said, I'm gonna link her channel. Check her out, she has a ton of knowledge, and I will highly recommend that you give her channel a look at, but she does a ton of layering combos. And I thought the same thing. I'm like, no matter who wears what, nobody's gonna wear it like you wear it. So no matter how many people are rocking it, there's only one you and there's only one me. So rock it and rock it with confidence. That's all I say. And that is it. Now today is Sunday. So if you wanna see what I wore on Sunday, cause I'm getting ready to go out, I gotta go switch, change and do it all over again. And then I'm gonna pick my fragrance for Sunday night. So if you wanna see what I'm wearing on Sunday, make sure you're following me on Instagram or make sure you tune back in next week because I think this is gonna be a thing. As long as it doesn't get repetitive, I'll probably get through my entire collection by just sharing with you guys what I reach for each week. If you like this type of content, definitely give this video a huge thumbs up. Definitely share it with a friend and definitely leave me a comment in the comment section below. I love hearing from you and chatting with you. If we have not connected over on Instagram yet, make sure you come over and say hi and I will see you beautiful souls in the next one. Until next time, you know the drill, be blessed stay fit and definitely stay fabulous duelings thanks for watching bye